best case scenario is that a ceasefire will be established once again, as well as the concrete plans for ending the conflict to restoring humanitarian access and aid to the population, as well as laying out a way forward for a sustainable peace process in Ethiopia. Overcoming the trust deficit is going to be the largest challenge in these peace negotiations. Uh, this is also something that the U.S. Special Envoy for the Horn of Africa, Ambassador Hammer, noted, and that the African Union, as well as the United States and other players, can play a critical role in building confidence between the parties. The war in Ethiopia is the largest ongoing conflict in the world today, and the largely man-made humanitarian crises that it has created present a key challenge going forward. This includes uh, lack of access to humanitarian aid, lack of access to basic services, as well as rising food insecurity. Um, beyond the Tigray region, there have been reports of casualties and conflict in the Amhara and the Afar regions, showing that the conflict is spreading just beyond the Tigray region, meaning that uh, peace building processes and conflict resolution will need to extend throughout the country. The Ethiopian government has largely resisted intervention from the international community, but the African Union plays a key role in setting the stage for peace talks to take place. Um, the fact that they're holding it in South Africa, convening the parties and offering a platform to dialogue is absolutely critical. They are providing a platform to build trust, to build confidence and open doors for the parties to talk with each other and find a way forward. This conflict has been marked by the scope and scale of civilian involvement and civilian casualties, as well as atrocities reported to have been committed against civilian populations, including starvation and rape used as a weapon of war. There is no military resolution to this conflict that has been a position held by the US government as well. And these peace talks uh, held by the African Union are really the best way forward, the best hope for the millions of Ethiopians who are suffering due to the conflict.